Oye, mi gente, it's Louis the Boiler Man. Good morning. I'm in the best room, the boiler room. That's right, guys. We're actually here working in Baldwin, New York. And we actually work on this oil boiler. I can't talk too loud because uh, people are sleeping still upstairs. But we work on this oil boiler because something transpired. I'm not sure. I think they had a scare with carbon monoxide. So we're actually going to do a carbon monoxide test. So we actually have two things. We have um, a Testo, which uh, I'll show you right now. A Testo 320 to do a combustion test. Exactly. And we also have a carbon monoxide detector, which I want to measure the PPMs. So we want to, you know, make sure and rest assured that they're safe and that they have no carbon monoxide poison, which we know that is deadly. And also that everything's working a-okay. In this case, we work on an oil board, you guys can see. Of course, they have this thing that's so illegal. I mean, I don't understand why people do what they do, but they have a fucking, uh, one of these accordion style exhaust pipes for a dryer on the chimney stack. I, I just don't understand people. But anyway, we're not here for that. We'll, we'll take care of that. We'll let her know that it has to be, um, address but well, we're here for the carbon monoxide test all right guys in order to test the efficiency on this boiler we have to make a hole in the stack and do it on the bottom all right guys we're ready to do a combustion test as you guys can see here so it's a little blurry but we got to put it to oil number two oil because that's what we're using we should, so right now we're gonna go that's okay Blue analysis, then we gotta go to number two oil, which is right here. Press OK. Alright, now we're ready. First you gotta let the zero out. Alright, it's reading right now. Pretty chilly, it's 51 degrees, it's the ambient temperature. It's like about 313. We actually did a, a combustion test. The test came out fine. Um, it was a little off, you know, a little CO, but a little high, but it wasn't that bad. We'll use this tool, which che checks for carbon monoxide. Again, it checked out very, very little. But what concerns me is that exhaust pipe. So I told the lady we have to remove that exhaust pipe. They had a no dry here, no dryer vent. So they put a new washer and dryer, as you guys can see, but they put they rerouted the way it's supposed to be on the side of the house. On this, on the old vent, they left it here, it's dangling. So I think that was the reason why they called this with the CO, because they have a smell. And also, I suggest to do a tune-up and a full cleaning on the boiler, because they haven't done it quite a while. And of course, when I check the flame, it's running a little rich, which is, it means a little smoky. So what we're gonna do here is do a tune-up on the burner, filter strainer nozzle. We're gonna clean the boiler itself. And I'm gonna have my chimney company to go check the chimney, make sure everything's okay. And we're also gonna remove this vent. So that's another day at New York Boiler with Louis the Boilerman. So guys, stay tuned because we have great content coming your way. Weba.